Hello everyone! I got a couple of requests to analyze the 7.2 trailer and give some information with it since, let's be honest, it's one hell of a trailer. Let's begin this video with actually showing the trailer for those of you who haven't seen it yet. Champions, your victory at the Nighthold has granted us the key to ending this war. With the pillars of creation assembled, we finally have the power to cut the demons off from our world. Gul'dan failed, and so shall the Legion. Gul'dan was merely their pawn. Until victory is assured, we must remain vigilant. For the Legion's true masters, have yet to reveal themselves. Among them, the monster who hunted my people across the stars. Kill Jaden. The day I took the fell fire into my veins, I saw my destiny. Crusade that would reach the ends of creation. That was the vision you showed me. Our crusade will prevail. Everything we have done has been by your design, and all we have to show for it is failure. Perhaps you lost sight of our destiny. Perhaps I overestimated your resolve. I paid for that destiny with my world. The time has come to see it done. Members of the Order Halls are gathered, as Kedgar is feeling pretty confident of we brought the Gul'dan down, but Velen, he knows that the Warlock was just a warm-up and the real threat is still out there. After being forced to take out his son, Velen is more than ready to finally stop running away from the Legion and take the battle to them. Now somewhere far away, Kill Jaden is watching this little conversation and notice how he almost seems sad when listening to Velen talk about him. All Kill Jaden ever wanted was to be loved, was to have Velen join up with them in the Legion, which is why he hunted the Draenei for so very long. Long, which is why the whole Rise of the Horde storyline, the destruction of Draenor, why that all came to be. He actually talks with Sargeras in the trailer, and this is not the first time that we hear his voice, since you can also hear him if you let Medivh fall during the opening of the Dark Portal dungeon. No! Damn this feeble mortal coil! And he spoke with Varimafras during the battle for the Undercity. I cannot hold! Destabilizing! You have failed me, Varimafras. It seems that Kill Jaden's pretty pissed with Sargeras, since so far all their schemes and plans and sacrifices, everything they've done for their Grand Crusade, even their home planet of Argus, which is now a stronghold of the Burning Legion, all that sacrifice and all they have to show for is failure. This disgruntlement is not a huge surprise for those who have checked out the PTR Dungeon Journal, since Kill Jaden's description says, Since striking the bargain, that chased the Draenei into the stars, Kill Jaden believed the Legion could not be stopped. Yet none of his deceptions have prevented us from reaching this critical moment. In Infuriated that Sargeras' promise of victory has never come to pass, the Demon Lord prepares to face us himself for the final battle that will shape Azor's destiny forever. Now I love the fact that they've made Kil'jaeda more than just a mindless follower of Sargeras and how it ties in with some old speculation. Way back when during the Burning Crusade, we faced Kil'jaeda before on Azeroth and during that encounter he said, Now I shall succeed where Sargeras could not. I will bleed this wretched world and secure my place as the true master of the Burning Legion. The end has come! 
Let the unraveling of this world commence. This dialogue sent people into overdrive with speculation. What exactly was going on within the Legion? Was Kill Jaden going to kick Sargeras and replace him as the master? And I love that they've actually kept that mindset in. Love that Kill Jaden is working together with Sargeras, but he's not that happy with how things are turning out right now. Now, as a final note for this trailer, and most of you probably already noticed this, but the similarities between Archimon during Warcraft 3 as he got ready to destroy Dalaran, and now Kill Jaden during Legion as he's getting ready to destroy Dalaran, I thought that was a very nice touch. And now here we are, ladies and gentlemen. Patch 7.2 is around the corner, and we're ready to take the battle to the Broken Shore, where we once got our asses handed to us, now we're going to fight our way back in. We have the two Sargeras to conquer, we have the Pillars of Creation to use, and hopefully we're going to put a stop to this Legion invasion. 